Thinking like a bank. One of the best insights of really understanding the compound interest formula is that it allows us to see the world the way our bank does. Notice that the Y in the compound interest formula represents the yield that our bank can earn on its money. It's the same letter Y representing the interest rate that we pay on our debts. One man's debts are another man's way of growing their money. The debt we pay on is the bank's way of earning monthly compound interest. What I want to introduce with that idea that, that yield and interest rate are the same thing is what I consider a, a, a key concept of personal finance and the key concept of thinking like a bank or thinking like an investor or thinking like an insurance company is that interest that you pay on your debt is seen from the other side of things, from the bank's perspective, that's their yield. That's, that, that's, their, that's their rainbow bridge. Referring to my preferred metaphor of interest rates as the rainbow bridge. So you are paying money and they are earning money. So their money is going, if, if you have a debt, then the person on the other side of that transaction is taking their money and they're growing it by that yield. And, and that's how they analyze your loan. They've got a, uh, a spreadsheet full of your loans, and they're going, mmm, 4% yield. And you're going, well, I'm paying interest rate. And, and I think a lot of people don't understand that debt is, your debt is somebody else's investment. It's the bank's investment. It's the same thing. And it's the same number, the same rainbow bridge, both ways. I had a, I, in 2004, I started a hedge fund, um, better known as a private limited partnership investment firm. Uh, and I bought debt. I'm a debt buyer. I'm a debt buyer. So occasionally I would introduce myself and people, what do you do? Uh, oh, I have debt. Would you like to buy my debt? What that told me is that, and these are perfectly bright folks. Um, you may be thinking, hey, debt buyer, I've got debt. Maybe you'll buy my debt. No, I won't. Your debt is somebody else's investment. So your bank is, is a debt buyer, basically. Every investor is a debt buyer. Anybody who has what's called fixed income or, or invests in bonds or loans, somebody's debt is somebody else's investment.